When you get a new router or need to change your Wi-Fi network, your SWAN security cameras will need to be reconnected. This process involves resetting the camera's network settings and using the SWAN security app to establish the new connection. The reconnection process is managed through the SWAN security app, which provides a user-friendly interface to configure your cameras and monitor your security system. As of 2025, SWAN cameras support WPA3 encryption, which is the current industry standard for wireless security. This enhanced security protocol provides better protection against unauthorized access, but you'll need to ensure your new router is compatible with WPA3. Newer SWAN camera models feature quick reconnect technology, which has significantly streamlined the setup process. This improvement reduces reconnection time from the previous 10 to 15 minutes down to just three to five minutes for most models. SWAN offers three main types of security cameras, each with slightly different reconnection requirements. Understanding your camera type helps ensure you follow the correct reconnection process. Each camera type may require slightly different steps during reconnection, but the core process remains consistent. Reset network settings, use the SWAN security app, and follow the guided setup wizard for your specific camera model. The most common method for reconnecting your SWAN camera is through the app. This process involves three main steps that we'll walk through together. First, you need to reset your camera's net network settings. Locate the reset button on the back of your camera and hold it down for exactly 10 seconds. Next, open the SWAN security app on your phone. Make sure you have version 4.2 or later for the best experience. Navigate to your camera's device settings. In the app, select Change Network from your camera's settings menu. The app will guide you through a setup wizard that may include scanning a QR code to automatically transfer your network credentials. Now let's look at the WPS method, which is faster but only available on compatible camera models. For WPS connection, you'll need to press the WPS button on both your router and your camera. First, press and hold the WPS button on your router. Then, within two minutes, press the WPS button on your camera. The LED indicators on both devices will show when the connection is successful. Finally, there's the Ethernet bridge method for advanced users who need more control over the configuration process. This method involves temporarily connecting your camera to your router using an Ethernet cable. Once connected, you can access the camera's web interface to configure the Wi-Fi settings directly. After completing any of these methods, verify the connection in your SWAN security app. Your camera should now be connected to your new network and ready to use.